for those of you who are first time in my channel. So the MC20 Maglu, one meter small in diameter, maximum power 20 watts. And it is standing on a small aluminium uh, tripod. And um, I guess that maybe one or a little more than one meter is the height of the antenna about the ground. So you can see that is not an extra height. And uh, of course we have here the Zygu X6100 and this is actually for the first time in this year 2024 with my external uh, operation or outdoor operation because finally we have a little better uh, weather conditions. Antenna now is beaming southwest. As you can see, yeah, it is southwest, so I think it's better if the antenna will be west and east because of the propagations. This is west-east. Hello CQ, is there anybody on the frequency? Ah, first station over there. Uh, Foxtrot for Echo Germany, Germany. Oscar Mike Zero Echo Tango QRP. Do you copy? I don't know if he is calling me or not. I think I'm not alone. Okay, the QRP station from France, Foxtrot 4, Echo, Golf, Golf, Oscar Mike Zero, Echo, Tango, QRP. Do you copy? You are 5-9, over. Ah, this noise. Okay, thank you for the five and six. Thank you for five and six. You are five and nine. You are five and nine. I'm running ten watts. I'm running ten whiskey. Okay, ten watts. QSL. I probably need to change the frequency. Okay, IC705. Okay, thank you, my friend. Thank you, my friend, for the QRP to QRP contact. Okay, thank you for QRP to QRP contact. Best 73 to you, my friend, and hope to see you soon again. Bye bye. All right. Okay, thank you. 7-3. Bye-bye. There was a question regarding how I tune my Maglub antenna. It is actually very simple. You need to, you, you need to see the antenna also. Um, I switch my radio to the AM modulation. It should be a carrier mode like FM, AM or digital. Uh, you have to... The first step how to tune the Maglub antenna is you have to tune the antenna right there on the bottom. There is a knob uh, on the bottom. Tune the antenna until you will hear the noise peak on the radio. The best is, uh, the best is to switch your radio to the AM modulation because there you can hear the noise peak. So the first uh, thing is to able to uh, tune your Maglub antenna to the band you desire it. So if you are on 20 meters, you have to choose the frequency where you want to work. And then you need to tune the uh, knob on the bottom until you hear the noise peak on the radio. Then you know that you are uh, tuned to the band and to the frequency. And the second step is to 
push the PTT button. I have PTT right there, but also you have to push the PTT button on on the mic, whatever. Um, so when you push the PTT button in AM mode, then you have to uh, check the SWR right here. When the SWR is high, you need to very gently, very gently um, tune the antenna um, until you can get the best SWR and the best as possible. So in my case, it was 1.1 or 1.2. Uh, then is your antenna perfectly tuned to the frequency and uh, you can switch back to the single sideband modulation and you can transmit with your transceiver to, to this antenna. So this is actually how it works. Yeah, there is, the, there is the knob right there on the bottom. Uh, it's not uh, visible right now, but I can show you that. So here you can see that in the detail, there is the knob, it's a little bit in dark, but it is there, yeah, right now, you can see that. So I'm tuning it with this knob, and yeah, very important thing is to have your radio in AM mode. All right, I need to change the frequency because this is very noisy, as you can see right next to me. Antenna is very sensitive, so you can... And... Uh, as you can see, I moved uh, from the center frequency a little bit to the side. And if I go back to the AM mode, you will see that there is a change in SWR. And you see that SWR is slightly, uh, slightly higher because uh, the Maglub antennas are mostly very narrow band, very sharp. So if you wish to get the best SWR, you need to go back to the antenna, AM mode, and gently tuning the antenna until you can see the best SWR. Okay, you see, it is almost 1.1. Yeah, there is a, a little influence of my hand. All right. So now I should be tuned to the frequency. Every frequency is uh, occupied. I think it's going to be uh, better to go to 17 meters. I think that there is the contest still in progress. I'm not sure. But my favorite frequency, 113. And uh, as you can see, I, I moved to a different band. I need to get the noise peak because I'm in the different band. So I'm going back to the antenna and I'm going to find the noise peak. Here is the noise peak. And coming back and forth and back. And this is the center of the noise peak. So now I am in AM mode. I will tune the antenna for the best SWR. And as you can see, I am... <laughs> so I'm ready to work on frequency 18113. All right, guys, so this was my QRP operation 
from my garden actually the first one in the in this new year 2024 in case if somebody is interested in this uh, maglub antenna i have my call sign uh, uh, or my website with my call sign oscar mike zero echo tango dot com there is a lot of more information about this maglub antenna it is called like mc20 like manual controlled 20 watts and also we are working on the remote control version uh, we are working on this uh, remote control version i think more than two than two years already yeah we are currently in uh, in a state that uh, we have the antenna almost uh, almost finished uh, we have a uh, couple of uh, uh, prototypes uh, finished and still working on a software programming uh, books uh, fixing and uh, hardware book fixing and so on so it's still in progress but currently the only mc20 and uh, beautiful H uh, X one six one hundred QRP transceiver. Okay, guys. So seventy three. Have fun and take care. Bye. Good luck.